Good morning everybody. Yesterday was a rough day, but today I think it's going to be better I do. you got to pick yourself back up and keep going. Look at my poochie staring at me. <laughs> Cutest dog ever, he's so cute. <laughs> do you see this child here? <laughs> <laughs> This child is our little miracle, aren't you? Yeah. Mm -mm. So, mm -mm. <laughs> so if you have PCOS and you're watching this, it is possible. Mm. Yeah. She keeps mm -mm. she keeps us going every day, don't you? Don't you? Mm. <laughs> she does. She cheers me up. Time to get dressed. Mm -mm. Have you got school? Mm -mm. Yeah, you got snotty nose. Ew. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know if you can see me, but I can't see. But it's time to do some shopping. It's that time again. <laughs> so we're going to good old Asda. He's tormenting me. <laughs> You're gonna tickle me. He's tormenting me. God help me, please. He's got his hyper head on. Um, yeah, you have. No, I am. <laughs> Look, I got a mocha from McDonald's. Look how cute them cups are. Oh. Hello, spring. Proper cute them. YouTube. <laughs> Sometimes I just want to kill him. <laughs> Proper cute them cups, aren't they? <laughs> Get out this can now. If you spill that, then you're not even getting it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I proper choked on the drink then, it's so stupid! Right, you know because my new hobby's got <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> That face is just funny! Right, yeah. as I was saying, <laughs> my, new ga my new gardening, my new hobby is gardening at the minute. <coughs> Do you have to disturb me like that, <laughs> freaking pig? They're out the attic, they're in the basement. <laughs> okay. Yep. Right, we are visiting a garden centre again, and I will try and get snippets, but I do get paranoid, like I've said before. Yeah, so she's gardening. <sighs> That's about it, really. Um, we're back from shopping. I don't think I managed to get any clips from the garden centre. <sighs> but I'm going to do a little haul for you, for what i got from the shops. So I'll start off with this side. Partner as always has got the chops, which I don't like. And then he got some steak. And two packs of chicken, because we're going to do some chicken and lettuce wrap. And some sausage rolls. And he's already tucked into these. And these are the white crusty rolls, which are beautiful. And then we've got some wraps for the chicken wraps. This is my, oops, this is my partner's cereal. Um, that is not supposed to be there. <laughs> um, I got these because these are beautiful. They're like a healthy snack. Toffee and Pecan, the Whitworth Shops 
um, raisin and chocolate, berry and white chocolate and fruity biscuit. These are really, really nice. 50p each though, but they're still nice. And then I am going to be starting Slim Fast. It's been a long time since I've been on Slim Fast, but it works. So I'm desperate to lose some weight for my PCOS. So this is what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. Start tomorrow. And then soy milk for my daughter. And we stocked up on some fruit. Got two packs of pomegranate seeds. Um, we've got some peppers again, some lettuce for our chicken and lettuce wraps. Um, and then two packs of watermelon. Because we like our watermelon. And then my partner calls this grass. <laughs> um, got some cress for the salad wraps. And then this is my, my daughter's toothpaste. And then she's running out of vitamins, so we've got her some multivitamins. Um, my favourite deodorant. Honest to God, I'll never go back from this. It's so good. Lasts forever. Um, and then I've got these treats for tonight because it's my last treat before I start my slim fast. So that's my treat. And I've got this because, as you know, we do a Star Trek with my daughter. So I've got this little one. Um, and then we're obviously doing gardening. So we've got this to kill all the weeds i will show you when i'm out there because i'm off out there in a minute to do some gardening but it's my new hobby if i'm honest i love it and then i've got this because i don't want to be kneeling on concrete because you know i'm old <laughs> and that's it for the haul <laughs> hello well look at this look at this hair crazy hair because i've been in the garden again <laughs> as you know i am obsessed with gardening at the minute i absolutely love it and when you see the finished result of what work you've actually done, it feels amazing and it's so therapeutic. Is that what you call it? Therapeutic. Very relaxing, even though it's hard work. But my back's killing me, so I've just had to take painkillers, have a sit down before I go back out. But yeah, I understand why my nan used to do it now, because it's, it's actually really, really relaxing and it relaxes your mind. You know, if you've, you've got anxiety or depression, or you, you're just struggling at the minute, get out in the garden, do some gardening, it's amazing what it can do. Because me and, me and my partner used to absolutely hate gardening. We used to hate it. Didn't we, Carl? Yeah. We used to freaking hate it, but I absolutely love it now, and so does Colin. So we're absolutely obsessed, and we spend most times in garden centre or in garden. <laughs> and it's really good. It's a really good workout as well, so if you... One of these people that absolutely hate gardening, you think, oh my god, I can't stand it. Honestly, give it a try, because I love it now. It's one of my hobbies, I think. Yeah, so. This is the finished result. It looks really, really good. And... We took a pictures from it. I can't see a thing, you'll have to do it. We've put some stones here, because it was full of weeds. Absolutely jam-packed full of weeds. So, that's what I've done to the window. And we'll probably put some solar lights there as well. Uh, and down there I've cleared all the path. You can see all that rubbish there. That's garden rubbish. So yeah. We've not done too bad. We're working on the back garden now so I'll show you the completed look once we're finished. It's a long while later, I'm all showered. You see in the garden, I've shown you a clip. Um, I'm raring to go tomorrow, I'm so excited. It just makes me so motivated. And it's a big deal that for me and Colin, because we've both had mental health issues and we're getting there slowly. Some people might wonder why I show all the, you know, the bad moments in my life, my breakdowns. Um, but I do it because stuff like that happens every single day people go through it every single day and nobody has as some people might not have a clue but depression and anxiety and infertility problems are so common and it's pretty awful when you think about it so I don't have a problem sharing all the Neg negative bits in my life because I want it to be 
how you say, real. I want it to be as real as, um, I can't explain, I just want to show the real me and what happens in life with plenty of people. So that's why I show all my negative bits in life and my breakdowns and my struggles because it's just life. A lot of people go through it themselves. Um, and it just shows that you're not alone, basically, doesn't it? Um, but you just got to keep rising above it, have your little meltdown and carry on because the next day is a new day. So you got to keep on going. <laughs> As my partner, as my partner told me, what did you tell me? I don't remember. Yesterday, he he gave me a little talk, and I'm normally the wise one, and but it seems to have reversed a bit. So Colin's the wise one now, and he says if you some like if you feed the negative, your life's gonna be negative all that time, but if you feed the positive, your life will be more positive. I cannot explain what I said yesterday because I weren't very good as you seen. But <laughs> it's true. So, yeah. So I don't know what I'm going to do now. I think we're waiting on Hollyoaks. I don't know if anybody else watches that. It's a UK soap. Um, yeah, so that's what we're going to do. Right, I'm thinking I better end this video now because it's getting really long. And I'm doing it on my phone, as you know. So I'll end it now. Um, I do hope you enjoyed. Please comment, like and subscribe and I'll see you tomorrow.